by the hands of JoJo. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, please welcome Sir, owner what? of World Professional Wrestling, the Flamingo Kid, Pinky. The owner of the owner of our company, WPW, the Flamingo Kid, Pinky. Pinky out of the box. No kidding. It looks like a cake. Are we in check with the AC now? Is it on? Yeah, I thought he came up and said that he had it going. No? Okay. All right, well, I apologize for it being a little warm in here. Uh, I guess some of you is... I'm sweating. Are you, you know, sweating? I'm that, sweating. Uh, it's too damn hot in here, Big One of our wrestlers that have been with us for, for about maybe, I would say, 10 years she's been here. Um, wrestling here at WPW and... Uh, at this time, I'd like to bring out uh, Debbie Sue, and yeah, most of you guys know her as Psycho Bitch. She wrestles as Debbie Sue here at WPW, and she is the, the current ladies uh, heavyweight champion. At this time, I'd like to bring her out here to the ring. This is a Kodak moment now. You know, Debbie, 10 years, you ran around here at WPW in eight of them years. If I'm not mistaken, coming from IWA, was that seven or eight years ago she was the ladies' champion here for the first time? Help me out, Terry. Going back, working for me now for 10 years, Debbie gave me some unfortunate news, let me know that she was going to retire in wrestling. You know, girl, I, I watched you from the very beginning. I know I came in this business about six or seven years prior, and you know, I had a little time under my belt when I see you come in, and I knew in my heart that's why you were the ladies' champion for as long as you were because you bust your ass in this ring for these people each and every show that you do. You know, and, and I want to, as you can see, I want to thank you for the 10 years that you put in us, and I wish you all the luck in your endeavors with whatever you do. My suggestion, TNA, WWE, that's where you should be going, girl. That's where you should be headed. I'm getting out of this business. And you should be going down there and let them take a look at you. And I'll tell you what, there's some big girls in the business that I see make it in WWE and TNA, and you're a hell of a lot better worker than they'll ever be. That's coming from my heart. So, Debbie, I love you, girl. And I wish you all the luck in the world with whatever you do. It's been fun, and uh, like I said, it's going to be hard to follow up anything in WPW in the ladies' division with you leaving. As of right now, when you hand that belt over to me, I'm going to retire it, so there isn't going to be another ladies' champion here in WPW ever again. Not like you ever were. I can tell you that. Something you want to say, huh? Nobody ever thought I would be doing this. Right, Missy? Nobody ever thought I was 
very quiet in school. And I decided to try wrestling. Actually, my brother talked me into it. And as much as I hated being psycho, I know how many of you all loved it. And Terry, thank you. You're talking me to go You're doing that, Kimmy. I also have to thank Rapid Fire Maldonado for training me. A lot of the guys from IWA, they also helped train me. Thank you, Pinky, for booking me. I'd like to thank all the bookers for booking me. They didn't have to, but they can. There are times where I come to the show and I'm like, oh, I really don't feel like wrestling. But as soon as my music hits, I hear you all clapping for me. It just makes me want to keep on going. I want to thank my parents. They're here tonight. Thank you so much. I started and I had my first match here in this building. And I believe I had my last match here. Thank you all so much. that from the bottom of my heart. And you know, as well as these fans do, you're always welcome back here at WPW. And if you do come back, I feel real sorry for whatever girl has this title. I really do, man. Okay, thank you very much. Um, we got you a cake here from WPW. You can share this with the fans. If you want to take it back there to the table, back to the bar. You can slice, dice, cut it up, and you can take and share with your mom and dad. Thank you for coming. I'm glad that you guys are here for her last appearance in WPW. Thank you. Terry, come here, buddy. I don't know if too many of you know who this is, but this is uh, the man they call the loose man, Terry Frank Kobiak. Started running IWA here in this building, um, I would say back 14, 15 years ago. WPW only started running this building about 10 years ago, and this is the man here that made WPW possible by helping us out to get started with a license in this building. So this is one of the big things, though, and I wanted to at least um, acknowledge that fact with, um, with Terry Frank Kobiak, because Terry, this is where she started with you in IWA, my friend, and I know you'd have something to say to her. So I'm going to hand this over to you for one second. All right, buddy? One. Hey, Dad, didn't we have some fun down in Philadelphia? Remember the first time we wrestled and you got all that money because I lied my ass off? Dad, I know you just started. My greatest story of Dad is down in Philadelphia. She became so popular. One night we were down, I was down with a promoter from Philadelphia. We were in a limo, and it was a, he, he owned a women's wrestling league. All his wrestlers were in um, altar tops and thongs. And as the girls were coming out of the limousine, the guys, you know, were flocked around. They were watching. After the last girl, and a halter and thongs came out, they're still waiting for somebody to come out. And I said, who are you looking for? And they said, we're Cycle Bitch. <laughs> they wanted to see Cycle Bitch more than a do half a dozen girls and thongs, and that's how popular she was down in Philadelphia. We had so much fun down there. I want to thank Terry, thank Kobe once again. Like I said, 
WPW would have never came into existence if it wasn't for this man right here helping me out about 10, 11 years ago to get this thing started. And Debbie, you know, like I said, to make things real short, I want to thank you. I'm sure that all the guys in the back want to thank you for all the time that you spent here at WPW. And we wish you all the luck. And like I said, there's always a spot open for you in that back room to be with us guys anytime you want. So you keep that in mind, okay? All right? So I don't want you to leave upset. I want you to remember, leave with a smile on your face knowing that when you come back here, like I said, I hate to see who the girl is that has that title around her waist when you do come back. All right? Good luck to you, Debbie. Well, we here, everybody here at WPW wishes Debbie Sue the best in her life and everything she Ladies does from now on. Super emotional moment here. I mean, that is without question a WPW legend. I'm retiring right now.